So congratulations. Uh, I was at the screening last night. Me too. Everyone was, <laughs> as you know, everyone was applauding you, especially after certain scenes. So that was like, very amazing. <laughs> yeah, I was going to say, like, what, what does that mean to you, you know, knowing that your performance is being so well received? Um, it's kind of, it's a bit surreal, to be honest, <laughs> uh, really. Uh, uh, hearing everyone say such lovely things is, um, it's quite overwhelming. Uh, when everyone clapped in the in the in the screening after that scene, um, oh, yeah. I just burst in tears. I was crying my eyes out, and I was like, "Oh my god, I'm done some of this makeup to forever. I gotta just, I gotta keep it good." But I it just it's like it, everything you hope for, you know. Like so far, the reactions have been really lovely. So it means the absolute world. Of course, <laughs> yeah, that's great. And for all the you know aspiring actors out there, I was yeah. curious, you know. How were you able to sort of overcome, you know, any fears and taking on this very intense and vulnerable character? Honestly, I'm I am convinced that I can't do it like right up until we start rolling. Okay. Genuinely, honestly, it's like before I read it on the page and I've got it in my head and I, I think like there's no way I'm going to be able to get there. There's no way I'm going to be able to do this. And then when the pressure hits, when the, the the cameras are on and everybody's in the room and everybody's watching you, it's like you have no choice. You have to get there. And so you just do, and it just happens. And honestly, I think with people wanting to try acting and wanting to do it, it's like all of that self-doubt, that's okay. That will pass, hope, hopefully, like at some point. But once you get up there and you start doing it, if it's meant to, if you're meant to do it, it, it just it just comes. So that's yeah, great. just well, give it a go. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> no, that's great. And um, do you feel that, you know, doing a sort of supernatural project like this, do you feel like any sort of past projects like Servant or, you know, anything like that maybe help prepare you for the role of Margaret? Yes, Servant definitely yeah. prepared me for the role of Margaret. I, I couldn't have played Margaret when I was 19 and I first started Servant, I don't think. Well, I couldn't have played her to, you know, to the extent I played her now. And because I hadn't, there were so many things I hadn't learned yet, so many things I hadn't tried. You know, I'd done quite measured roles before then, and you know, Leanne was measured, and she was centered and quiet. She was observer, but um, she got quite, uh, quite erratic towards the end, and like this, like f energy that like kind of started to fizz off of her, and it was a challenge to play then, and it really lent itself into helping me kind of move into into playing Margaret. You know, in general, would you welcome the opportunity to? Uh you know, be Hollywood's next screen queen. Sure, yeah. if they'll have me, <laughs> yeah. I'm happy to do it. Yeah. That's great. Are there other other horror franchises that you're interested in that you might be interested in joining? I don't know. Right now, I'm I'm focusing on this one. Yeah. But yeah. listen, if it happens, it happens. I'm I'm happy to give anything a go. I love the genre, so I I do really enjoy being a part of it. Yeah. Is there a particular Omen movie uh, before the first Omen, of course, that you were particularly fond of? You the know? original is fantastic. The, the, I always go to say the first Omen, but that sounds like I'm saying th <laughs> this movie was the best one. Yeah. Um, the, the original Omen is just, it's kind of, I think it's a perfect film, to be honest. Yeah. So, yeah. Massive, massive Richard fan. Donner. Oh my God. Yeah. Genius. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I, uh, you know, we sort of referenced that scene, you know, that everyone was applauding last yeah. night. I mean, I was curious what scene in particular was perhaps the most challenging for you to shoot, whether it be that one or if there was another moment, you know, during production that was yeah. daunting. Like what I was saying earlier about that, like not thinking I'm going to be able to do it until it's happening. That scene that we we were that we're talking about um, was a very very extreme case of that. It was like right before we did it, I was like, I don't know if I'm going to be able to do this. And then I was like, if I can scare a member of the crew who I'm really good friends with at this point, then maybe I'll be able to. And like before we even started shooting, so I just like positioned. We shot underneath this big church, and I just kind of positioned myself in the center of the church. And I just sat there and I stared. And then one of my friends, my really good friends, came over to me and was like, hey, do you want to water it? I'm going to leave you to it. I'll leave you be. And he walked away. And I thought, OK, if I can do that, then maybe I can do this. And I had Kasha there, and she just guided me through it. And, and then it ended up working, And um, I think, I hope. <laughs> and uh, it, was a, it was honestly incredibly challenging, but my, my favorite thing to shoot. For Wonderful. Sure. Yeah. Great. Thank you. Oh, oh thank yeah, you so yeah, much. Yeah. <laughs>